Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our High Calling, April 26th. A Jewel or a Pebble. In that day, saith the Lord of hosts, will I take thee, O Zerubbabel, my servant, the son of Shealtiel, saith the Lord, and will make thee as a signet, for I have chosen thee, says the Lord of hosts. Haggai 2 verse 23 Christians or Christ jewels. They are to shine brightly for him, shedding forth the light of his loveliness. The luster depends on the polishing they receive. They may choose to be polished or to remain unpolished. But everyone who is pronounced worthy of a place in the Lord's temple must submit to the polishing process. Without the polishing that the Lord gives, they can reflect no more light than a common people. Christ says to men, You are mine. I have bought you. You are now only a rough stone, but if you will place yourself in my hand, I will polish you, and the luster with which you shall shine will bring honor to my name. No man shall pluck you out of my hand. I will make you my peculiar treasure. On my coronation day, you will be a jewel in my crown of rejoicing. The divine worker spends little time on worthless material. Only the precious jewels does he polish after the similitude of a palace, cutting away all the rough edges. This process is severe and trying, it hurts human pride. Christ cuts deep into the experience that man, in his self-sufficiency, has regarded as complete and takes away self-uplifting from the character. He cuts away the surplus surface and putting the stone to the polishing wheel, presses it close that all roughness may be worn away. Then, holding the jewel up to the light, the master sees in it a reflection of himself, and he pronounces it worthy of a place in his casket. In that day, says the Lord of hosts, will I take thee, and will make thee as a signet, for I have chosen thee, says the Lord of hosts. Blessed be the experience, however severe, that gives new value to the stone and causes it to shine with living brightness. God will not suffer one of his true-hearted workers to be left alone to struggle against great odds and be overcome. He preserves as a precious jewel everyone whose life is hid with Christ in God. Our High Calling, April 26th.